Okay, hey everybody, Nico here. And I know this does not look like what I said I was going to be playing lately. I mean, this isn't Resident Evil, this isn't Tales from Symphonia, and this isn't... Well, I think you've probably all given up hope on me playing Grandia. But there's no need to do that, because I am going to play more Grandia soon. But today, oh, today I happen to be flipping through some streams earlier, and this little gem caught my eye. It's called The Dark Side Detective, and it looked like good fun when I watched the trailer after I caught a little bit of people's streams of it. Now, mind you, I don't know what the hell they were doing in their streams. I know this is a point-and-click adventure, and I know there's going to be a whole lot of reading for me, which in that aspect, I'm going to have to get up in a second and get some water to be ready for this. But, um, yeah, this looked right up my alley, especially considering how after uh, Dr. Decker and all that stuff, uh, I am quite fond of, uh, quite fond of, of indie games. And PC is a hotbed for them. I had to turn this volume down just a little bit, though. I don't mean the game volume. I meant my volume. It should be fine. Might be a little loud. Might not be. We'll see. I got my game set pretty good. Let me check my mic game. All right. It should be good. It should be good. All right, anyway, we're gonna start on this as soon as I get some water, and I will be right back. Okay, so water is claimed, voice is ready to go with the silliness, because this looks like it's going to be a silly, wonderful, wonderful thing. So yeah, let's get to it. Okay, there are case files, and I see that four of them are locked, and I literally know nothing about this. Let's check out some of the settings. Sound effects, music, I could turn that down a little bit, but I think I'll leave it be. Uh, police corruption. Don't know what that does, let's see still on. This is going nowhere. Should be giving up on this. Okay! <laughs> you don't learn, do you? Okay! Alright, so that's what that does. Super high defs. Virtual reality. Let's go with that. I don't know if it actually changes anything. I mean, it's an 8-bit, so I guess it really can't change the graphics all that much. How to play. Alright, that's something we need to know. Detective McQueen closes cases by talking to characters and solving puzzles. Left click to examine items or to talk to characters. Left click on inventory items for more information. Drag items onto the scene to use them. Drag items into each other to combine them. Right click and to skip dialogue. Hint, McQueen can sometimes wear items. Okay. Your progress is auto saved as you play. Please do not quit the game during a scene or transition. Your progress may be lost. Okay, gotcha game. I'm loving the style of this so far. Alright, so let's uh... Let's start opening up with the first case. I'm thinking we're going to, uh, Twin Lakes Police System Volume 13, or what happens to the other 12. Anyway, case files, Malice in Wonderland. I think that's the one we're gonna start with, so let's let's give her a go. Case summary, the chief has sent me to, jo to the Jones' residence. Dooley is here, is there for for further details. All right, let's read that again better. The chief has sent me to the Jones's residence. Dooley is there with further details. Let's start. All right, and that's just another rehash on how to play the game. Should I have not gone into options? But I did. And here we go. Alice in Wonderland. Oh wow, that's really big. 
Like, I'm sorry, it's gonna take me a little bit to get used to this. It's gonna mess with my eyes. Officer Dooley. Oh, I almost shot you there, detective. You shouldn't be sneaking around like that. Dooley, you've watched me drive up. Had my siren on. Uh, you waved me in as I pulled in. You waved at me as I pulled in. Uh, I guess this place has me spooked out a little bit. So what happened here? Chief Scully just called and uh, called me up and told me to get here ASAP. No details. Seven-year-old kid Alice went missing a day ago. No sign of her leaving the house. Seems to be the kind of seems to be the kind of spooky crap. I mean, the kind of case you're into, detective. Great. Let's get started. Um, Officer Dooley, what are you after you, detective? You know, whenever huh, you know, whenever standing in this rain stops being fun for you. I already like the humor in this game. Squad car. What's in the squad car? Our trusty squad car. Okay. I like to call it. <laughs> I like to call it Popo Moto. The Popo Moto. Um, I believe Dooley's gonna settle into a nice southern, uh, poorly done southern draw. This is not too. Ta uh, this is the best this southern girl can do. I don't really have much of a draw myself. All right, let's go in. Officer Dooley, why is there a hobo dripping all over my carpet? Um, that's Detective Francis McQueen, Mr. Jones. He's here to investigate. I see, Twin Lakes Finest, huh? Painting. Nice schooner. Haha, <laughs> you dummy. That's not a schooner. That's a sailboat. A schooner is a sailboat, Dooley. Ashtray, I hope you don't smoke around your kid. Thankfully, Detective, I'm rarely around my kid. Oh. Oh, these people. Options, exit to menu. Oh, we don't need any of that. Let's resume the game. Okay, so that's that's how we say, uh, how we exit the game, I guess. Upstairs, hallway. Well, let's talk to Mr. Jones. So, how can I help you, detective? Tell me about Alice. I'll level with you, detective. I don't have many dealings with her. She's a limited conversation pool. She's seven. Exactly, T.D. Sage. So I leave that to my to the nanny. She's around here somewhere. Okay, well, where were you last night? How come you didn't notice she was missing? I was out. I'm wonderfully shady. Have you got an alibi? Where, uh, where I was was none of your business, detective. My taxes pay your salary. They also pay the cell <laughs> pay for the cell phone and the cell and a questioning room. I'm gonna have Julie here take you to. Fine. Call this number. They'll vouch for me. Busty Bill's boo- uh, wait, wait. That's a lot of bees. Busty Bill's booty boutique. Classy stuff. Ah, Bell's Fun memories. What? I mean, um, where was he? A, a, a bell shop? What? Matches. Alright. Receive the matches. Jones, how can I help you, detective? Well, that's it for you. Not enough for your time. And I've got, uh, I have nothing further to say, detective. Kind of leave me be. All right. Try the hallway. The grandfather clock, study, closet, living room. The living room is where I just came from. Yeah, it is. Uh, uh, one second. Ah, oh, balls. I didn't, I didn't up my thing. Oh, well, this one's just going to be at a lower resolution, and next time I play, I'll bump it up to, to, to 70, so, uh, well, shit, it's not like you guys will notice 720 or, or, or 480 right now, to be honest. So, let's try the grandpa, let's see. This reminds me of my own grandfather. Your grandfather was a clock? What? No, he had a clock. Shame, I thought I finally found something interesting about you. What? I'm interesting. Whatever you say, detective. But we're going into the closet. Box of junk. Hmm. Black light bulb. May as well take it. Now all we need is a disco ball, some white clothes, and fat beats. Then we've got ourselves a good night. A good night will be finding this kid. Anything else in there? All the other junk is useless junk. Okay, so we're leaving. Um, click on this to see. Uh, black, uh, all right. black light. Busty Bell's Boutique. Yeah, the kid definitely did not win on the father's speech days. Alright, let's try the study. Locked, I wonder where I'd find the key. 
a good question. Well, there seems to be nothing there. Chandelier. One of those crystals. One of those crystals is worth more than I get paid in a year. You could take one. You uh, you you passed the corruption test. Well done, detective. Oh, Dooley, I don't know if I hate or love you right now. Uh, flowers. A place this fancy deserves something nicer than plastic flowers. But not a place for a telephone. They must have run out of places to draw. I mean, put it. <laughs> um, can I use these? Alright, this one busted boost. Alright, let's see. Can I? I better check Roy's alibi. We're dialing. Cool, that's how that works. Hello? Is this Bell? Busty Bell's booty petite. Busty Bell's bosom, uh, Busty Bell's bosom bordello. Busty Bell's bone. Yes, would have been enough. I'm a thorough woman. No questions left unanswered. No desire left unfilled. No fantasy left unexplored. No, I get the picture. Are you sure? I could send you one if you'd like. Uh, right. It was Mr. Roy Jones. Roy Jones. Roy Jones, light heavyweight champion of the world. Sorry, I'm a boxing fan, okay? This amuses me. Couldn't say. Client confidentiality. Identities are concealed. Sometimes in Mr. MS. This is a police matter. I'm Detective Francis McQueen. Francis McQueen of the Dark Side Division? Yes. Tell Dooley I say hello. I'm glad the screen resolution doesn't let you make out that I'm blushing. <laughs> like this so far this is pretty cool okay i'm happy to help a friend of dooley's yep roy boy was here last night roy boy some some questions even a badge won't get you answered okay all right well that's all i need then well that's all i need for now if you find yourself needing anything else just pop on by all right well there's daughter's room and there's the master bedroom um let's check out the master bedroom first I wasn't actually expecting somebody to be in here. Um, one second. I think my, my volume dropped out a little bit there. Alright, there. That should do it. Okay. Alice and her mom look quite happy here. Doors. It seems impolite to go rifling through somebody's drawers uninvited. Never stopped me before. It's never stopped me in a video game, Dooley. That nanny's beautiful. Ask her if she's single, you know, part of an investigation. No. Poor woman must be worried sick about her kid. We'll find her, detective. Nanny. Tell me about Alice. She, she spoils and sicks her nose where it does not belong. And, oh, wait, her name's Nanny McFiend. Well, I, I can't do a proper... I can't do a proper, uh... Proper Cockney accent or anything. So, yeah, that's not happening. Gubna! But that's what having super rich parents will do to you, I suppose. To Nanny doing in the bastard... Ma master, bastard master bedroom. Nothing suspicious, that's for sure. No siree. How long have you been working for the Joneses? The Jones is his detective. Even though it ends with an S, you still pluralize it. No, you don't. No, no, Dooley, you don't. It's now really the best time. It's always a good time for grammar. Anyway, answer the question. Long enough to have harbor no ill will what's huh? Long enough to harbor no ill will whatsoever. Say you're the nanny. Yes, very innocent nanny. Yes. Do you have keys of, uh, for the various rooms? I am a nanny, not a maid. Right, but do you? Yes. May I have the keys to the study then? Sure, there's nothing incriminating in there anyway. Study key, excellent. Well, we have the studying key. Anything else? Nope, that's all. For her. Belief, leave the room. All right, let's check the daughter's bedroom. Oh, my. Man, this could be a drawing of our suspect. Really? I'll put out an APB then. No, Dooley, don't do that. Tree. Looking at this, I doubt she's gonna be going to art school. 
She's seven. She's seven. What are you? She's seven. And this is pixel art. That's a pretty good tree. <laughs> I've never seen a horse with five legs before. I'm, I ain't commenting on that. I don't have much use for a dozen pink socks and pins. This is no time for art, detective. Blacklight. This looks useful. Black light marker. Okay. All right. I don't really know what I'm going to do with any of that stuff, but sure. Tell me where she is, bear. I'm only kidding. I know you don't know. You're only a bear. A stupid know nothing bear. Hello, can I ask? My baby! My baby is gone! Can you tell me about Jet? She just disappeared! My baby! Is there anything? You have to find her! I'm trying! Find her! Right, right. I'm trying, lady. Yeah, I know what it's for. Let's see if we can do anything with it. Anything? No? Alright, well, let's move along. And we're gonna go back downstairs and go to the study. Alright, let's uh, use the key on the study. And presto, we're in. Alright, let's look around the painting. Roy Jones Esquire. It takes a certain type of person to have an oil painting of themselves. Well, at least an oil painting of themselves in a study with that smug an expression on it, but anyway. Detective McQueen. I don't know why I read my name. A nice collection of books. Some dust suggests they've not been looked at for some time. A shame. The dog statue. The statue is ugly enough to be worth a lot of cash. An old, an old oil lantern. Seems to have some oil left, too. Oh, cool. Well, now we have that. And we can combine these two. Probably light this thing, you know, just in case. Lit lantern, and now I no longer have that. Magazine stack. His magazine magazine collection just. Jeez, this guy's obsessed with jugs. That, that is not the jugs I was expecting. <laughs> okay. All right, let's uh. Nothing in here that I can see. Uh, black light bulb for black. I know that. Let's see if we can use it anywhere. There. There. Alright, nope. Nope, nothing. Yeah, he's obsessed with jugs, so let's go out and see. Uh. Can't help but think this cheap plastic bulb. Uh, I can't help but think this cheap black light would look out of place in their fancy chandelier. So. We can still use it. I mean, you know. Okay, well, I'm kind of running at a loss here. So how can I help you, detective? Look through all that stuff. All right, so let's go back upstairs. Not really sure where to use this black light. Seems like a bad idea to me. What about this then? That's a rookie mistake. Oh no, not on my watch. Okay, so I'm just gonna have to go walk around and use this on things. It's not the room I meant to go into. Okay, okay, we can do this. Oh no, not on my watch. Rookie mistake. My watch. Uh, what about these? All right, there's gotta be somewhere I can use these. What do you think, Dooley? There's, this is a lot of pink. I think I have to run off. I think I have to run off too. Yeah, yeah, I don't like pink either. This, oh, there's an attic. I didn't even see that. Paint thinner. Paint thinner fell off the shelf. The paint thinner fell when the shelf gave way. Not much left now. Some left though. Maybe not broken after all, just a bone bow. Okay, so we can use this there. I know this doesn't reveal somebody's shame in the, uh somebody's attic shame. Oh, what the heck? What the heck indeed? Where the hell did that come from? Well, that doesn't look ominous at all. Okay. Oh, 
Those look heavy enough to knock somebody out cold. Okay. Okay. Right. Boxes. A box marked Anna's Broken Dreams. Anna's Broken Dreams. I got you. Okay. But we'll go through that in a second. We're gonna we're gonna try this on something. That's a rookie mistake. Uh you know what? Let's go back up there. Ah, okay. The pattern looks right. The pattern on the wall looks washed out in places. I wonder what would happen if I redrew it. I don't know. Let's find out. First, I need to know what to draw. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, I don't think that's gonna do anything here. Alright, I got an idea of somewhere I could try to use it. So we're gonna try it here. I don't like the painting, but we have no reason to ruin it. Uh. Okay, there's nothing else in there. Ow! Oops! Whoa! Sorry! Uh... Oh! Okay! Um... For a while break it too much? Jeez! Did you follow me into this closet? You may have needed backup? Okay, okay, uh... Grandfather clock. This reminds me of my grandfather. Alright! <sighs> hmm... You can never trust a man that has too many books, that's what I say. How many books are too many? Six? What? And how many books do you own? I don't feel comfortable with this line of questioning. This collection of books... This is curious. I found where to use the other thing. Nah, I like both to melt the melt this one. <laughs> okay, so I can't do that. Mr. Jones, there seems to be an evil doorway in your attic. Just as well, um, just as well you're here then. Go arrest it. It's trespassing. I'm sorry? You heard me arrested. I want to press full charges. Right. I really wouldn't feel that bad about melting his shit at that point. Um, there's a creepy- Have you found her? Have you found my baby? Not yet, but I wanted to ask. You have to find her! Oh please, my baby! My baby! Oh ho ho ho! Right. Goodbye. Goodbye, lady. There's only one person I can think of to talk now. Can you tell me about the demonic outdoor way in the attic? Nothing. Not a, a thing. It's nothing to do with me, that's for sure. I've been here the whole time. Uh... I'll get back to work and nothing else. Okay. It's a rookie mistake. Okay, well what the fuck can I use it on? Seems to have recently spilled paint thinner all over the wall. Okay. Light a minute. Bang. Uh. Oh no no no! Not on my watch. Um, boxes. Just a bunch of forgotten memories. Dooley, I don't like the looks of this detective. I'd have gone with the glow. Uh. I would have gone with glowing green myself, but this is creeper. This is... It's creepier. Well, I happen to like the glowing purple, sir. Okay, just like to say that. I like the purple. Also, at an utter loss here. This is fancy desserts. Blah, blah, blah. Run out of places to draw. I mean, yeah, yeah. Something I'm missing. I didn't mean to click off my screen. That was unintentional. A. 
Okay, so that's not the right place for it. Oh, I didn't mean to go in there. Teddy bear? Mr. Teddy bear? No, I guess not. Uh, shit. I was going so well, and now I'm a little stuck. I don't really know where I'm going. This is the only complaint I have with this game. Oh, so far. Maybe here, that's a rookie mistake. No. Guess not, then. new questions there, so I guess I have to move along. There's like, there's like no, nowhere I can use any of this stuff. It's worth a lot of cash. Maybe we spill it on that. It's like a bad idea to me. Guess, guess can't. Guess can't. I knew I need to use this. Uh, can I put this on me? Uh, fuck. Hey, there are only two seats in this house. Don't be daft, dude. We're here. For, uh, there are more. They're just off camera. <laughs> That's funny that they react to that. I like this so far. I just wish I knew what I was doing. Uh, maybe those magazines? It's like there's nothing. Oh, alright. The books. I'm actually at a complete loss here. I don't really know what I'm doing. It's like I'm trying to use it on all the stuff, but I don't know where to use it. I don't mind watch. And I know I don't need that there. I know where I need that. It's just I can't find it. And he wear it. It's a bad idea to me. Okay. Ah. can't do anything to the boat. Anything else won't let me do anything either, but what the fuck do I do? This is like, you know, the only thing I could use that on. What about this? Your mistake. Dooley! Any? Nothing to say. Waterbed. Very fancy. Looks like there's something been kicked under here. No, it doesn't. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, this is what I need. It's a peculiar pattern for the pull for, from, for Dummies book. Okay. Okay, well, let's try that. I didn't see that. Okay, so this is why you click around the room with stuff like that. Okay, it seems to have everything I need. Let's get down to some spooky hijinks and redraw those missing symbols. Pretty easy. Alright, let's find the right one. That should do it. That should be it. Yeah. Great. Maybe now's a good time to stop doing well anything really. Even I'm not foolish enough to go in there with no light. But I have light. Okay, Dulu, let's do this. No offense, detective, but I'm not going anywhere near that creepy, that creepy, that creep fest. I'll uh, stand guard out here. Hey, Alice. Hello, Mister. Hey, kiddo. Are you here to take me home? Yep. 
Good, I'm hungry, and it sounds... And the sounds downstairs... Blah, blah, blah. Good, I'm hungry, and the sounds downstairs are scaring me. Well, let's get you out of here. Oh, no. Not so fast, detective. Where's Dewey? That idiot, I knocked him out. I can't imagine... I can't have you snooping around anymore. I'm going to trap you here. At least take the girl. Oh, I intend to. I'm a legal guardian, after all. It's my job to look after her, especially after any... Especially if anything should happen to her parents. Say, for example, getting trapped in a dark side version of that bedroom? What is this? An inheritance scheme? You have to admit, it's a fairly perfect crime. It is, actually. Even if you get rid of me, then what? Alice knows what you're up to, and she's a smart kid. If she's so smart, then she'll know to keep her mouth shut. Good point. Once Dooley wakes up, you and your scream scheme will be done for. Hmm, good point. I'll just have to uh, drag him in here with you. Come on. Uh, well. Have a taste of your own medicine! No! Well, that problem's... <laughs> Well, that problem's solvent. Come on, Alice. Let's wake up Dooley and yeah, so he can tell. I can tell. <laughs> Come on, Alice. Let's wake up Dooley so I can tell him his, my pun. Pretend it's the first time you heard it, okay? Um, okay, mister. So the kid and the nanny, uh, the kid got into the nanny stuff and accidentally used the trap, used the trap herself in that creepy attic dark side, but surprisingly useful summary of things, yes. Shame the nanny was certifiable. She was a looker. Dooley, she was dabbling in the dark. She was dabbling in the dark arts. With a plan to trap innocent people in a paranormal world. Kidnap their kid and steal all their cash. I said it was a shame, jeez. I wonder where the nanny got the occult books from anyway. This stuff is hard to find these days. A case for another day, I guess. First of all, I have to figure out what kind of paper paperwork covers this mess. Case closed. Okay, well guys, I am going to do something I normally wouldn't do, but since this is going up on YouTube, I am going to do an outro now. So thanks for watching. If you've been watching on Twitch, remember to follow. It's much appreciated. We're trying to get to 70 and we're to the 66. Come on, guys, you know you want to. If you're watching on YouTube, remember to like and subscribe if you like what you've seen. And if you're watching on vid.me, do the same thing. And until next time, remember to save often. You'll live longer. Peace. <laughs>